مرحباً. Hello. Welcome to Arabic lessons today with me, Nada. Today our lessons topic is going to be about how to say what time is it in Arabic. So let's start our lesson together. So before starting to learn how to say what time is it in Arabic, let's learn some vocabs that are really important and that are also related to time. So let's start with the first vocab now. Second, thaniya, thaniya, minute, daqiqa, daqiqa, hour, saa, saa, day, yawm, yawm, week, usbuwa, usbuwa, month, shahr, shahr. And now, after learning those important vocabs, let's start learning how to say what time is it in Arabic. So, firstly, we're going to learn how to say the time is a number exactly, and then we're going to learn how to say it's one and a quarter or two and a half and so on. So, starting with how to say the time is a number exactly. But before that, When someone asks you what time is it, how to say that in Arabic or how to ask someone what time is it in Arabic? What time is it? Remember, I have told you that in a previous lesson. So if you have watched the lesson about Arabic sentences, I guess I have told you what time is it in Arabic is كم الساعة؟ كم الساعة؟ So you're going to answer and say الساعة and the number or the time. So الساعة الواحدة one الساعة الثانية two الساعة الثالثة three الساعة الرابعة four الساعة الخامسة five الساعة السادسة six الساعة السابعة seven الساعة الثامنة eight الساعة التاسعة nine الساعة العاشرة ten الساعة الحادية عشرة eleven الساعة الثانية عشرة 12. And you can add to that تماماً Exactly It's exactly 1 o'clock الساعة الواحدة تماماً It's exactly 2 o'clock الساعة الثانية تماماً So that's it for how to say what time is it when the time is exactly a number and now let's move on to how to say it's 1 and a quarter, 2 and a half and so on So let's see that in the next slide So now there's someone asking you, كم الساعة? And you look at your ساعة or time and you see the time is one of those on the left. So what are you going to tell them? So if you see the time three and five minutes, you're going to say الساعة الثالثة وخمس دقائق. ثالثة is three و and خمس five دقائق. دقائق is the plural of دقيقة which is minute دقائق is minutes so الساعة الثالثة وخمس دقائق now you look at the clock and it's 3 and 10 minutes you're gonna say الثالثة وعشر دقائق 10 minutes now you look again at the clock and it's 3 and 15 minutes or 3 and a quarter you're gonna say الثالثة والربع ربع is quarter in Arabic Now you look at the time or a saa and it's three and twenty minutes or one third. So you're gonna say a saa a thalitha wa thuluth. Thuluth is one third. Now you look at the time again and it's three thirty or three and a half. So you're gonna say a saa a thalitha wa nusf. Nusf is half. So a saa a thalitha wa nusf. So again, someone is asking you, كم الساعة? And the time is 2.55. You're going to say, الساعة الثالثة إلا خمس دقائق. Because it's not yet 3. It's 3 before, it's, it's 5 before 3. Or 5 to 3. You see, so it's not 3 yet. It's 3, الثالثة إلا خمس دقائق. But still, There are five more minutes to be three. Again, you look at the clock and it's 2.50. So 
so it's not three as well so it's ten to three so you're gonna say الثالثة إلا عشر دقائق so it's three but there are ten minutes before it so it's still not three yet again you look at the clock and it's a quarter to three so you're gonna say الساعة الثالثة إلا ربع and again you look at the clock and it's one third to three or two forty so you're gonna say الساعة الثالثة إلا ثلث so here's a quick quiz for you guys to test yourselves uh, I want you to tell me كم الساعة for A, B, C, D, E and F and in the next slide we're gonna read the answers together so get a pen and a paper and write down كم الساعة so for A الساعة الخامسة إلا خمس دقائق for B الساعة الخامسة والربع for C الساعة الثانية والنصف for D الساعة الثانية عشرة والربع for E الساعة الحادية عشرة إلا ثلث for F الساعة الثانية إلا خمس دقائق so again here I want you to test yourself again and now you're gonna tell me what time is it and take care here this time we have minutes so you're gonna tell me in numbers okay and we're gonna also read the answers in the next slide together so for A الساعة السادسة واثني عشرة دقيقة for B الساعة الثامنة وثمانية وعشرون دقيقة for C الساعة الخامسة وثمانية عشرة دقيقة for D الساعة الثالثة واثنان وأربعون دقيقة for E الساعة التاسعة وأربعة وأربعة دقائق for F الساعة الحادية عشرة وتسعة وأربعون دقيقة so this was the end of today's lesson i hope you enjoyed it and don't forget to follow me on instagram arabic underscore underscore lessons and it's the same link also on twitter and you can like my facebook page arabic lessons with nada and of course not to forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell to receive notifications for my upcoming videos you can also comment down below if you have any questions and don't forget to click on the like button down below if you liked this video and now i'm gonna tell you see you soon araakum qariban